take like how many hours to get me ready? Like three. 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 <laughs> it's great. It's a great day. <laughs> oh my gosh. Good morning. Today is October 5th. Today, Chris and I are getting married. It's so crazy. Oh my gosh. Today is the day. I can't wait. I can't even believe that it's real. Even crazier is the fact that we thought it would be really fun to kind of do this as a semi-surprise slash surprise for all of our friends and family. So some people don't really know what's going on. <laughs> And I'm just so excited to surprise everybody with this awesome day. But also I'm just so excited that I cannot believe that the day is finally here that Chris and I are getting married. It's so wild. And I'm by myself, obviously. We're not gonna see each other before the wedding. That was something that was super important to Chris that I thought was like just the cutest thing of all time. So he's by himself. Gonna be hanging out with some of his friends today. And the first time we're gonna see each other is when and I walked down the aisle, which is today, which is honestly so, so, so crazy. I just woke up, that's why I can't even really speak right now, but I love my babe, my bride today, and I can't wait to see you. You're gonna look so beautiful, my lobster. See you soon, love. All of our family and friends are here, they're all like, why are we here? What's going on? And I'm like, I don't know. We went to go meet up with a bunch of them last night and hang out and just celebrate and see everybody that's here in town in Scottsdale, which is where Chris grew up. All that really matters is that all of those people are here and it's gonna be an awesome day. So apparently when you're getting married, you have to start getting ready like 15 hours before the actual wedding. Guys, it's all happening. So crazy. Does my mom need to sign a permission slip for this? <laughs> so, it's been a couple hours. It's a big day. I have a couple of friends coming over, and there he what? is. Uh oh, perfect timing. Look at this guy. Time. <laughs> <laughs> it's the day. He just picked up the breakfast buzzes. Oh my gosh. Buzz alert. Can't wait. You ready? Let's do this. Ah. Uh, <sighs> <laughs> Love you, man. So I got up, I mobilized, I went into the kitchen and made some coffee. I'm actually staying at Chris's parents' house, which is the venue for the reception today. It feels so funny even talking about it because I feel like I've been like trying to be so elusive with all of my secrets. I have this coffee cup, which yes, is the size of my head. I wish it was bigger, to be quite honest. And I'm just gonna probably hang out for a little bit. It's so weird, everybody's like, today's your day. And I'm like, <laughs> people are here setting up for the reception. It looks really, really beautiful. I can't wait for you guys to see it. Just like kind of relaxing, which is weird and awesome. What up? It's game day. Super nervous, could barely sleep last night. Pacing around right now. I'm like, ah, <laughs> it's happening today. It's truly insane. And I got some of my best friends here. It's the day, you wanna see a tour of the place? Let's do it. Check it out. So thank you very much to Jerry. This is actually available on VRBO and Airbnb. So people can rent this place on First Avenue in Old Town. It's an old jewelry uh, store, I think, converted to a, a rental. Amazing location, super sick, heart of Old Town. You can walk to like everything. There's a barbecue out here. Yeah, a little patio. People can grill up some stuff on game day. Check it out on VRBO, 6920 East First Avenue. Woo! Ah! Yeah. Woo! Dude, should we do a little chest bump? Jump. <laughs> so I'm still wearing my sweet outfit. Yep, I'm wearing the same outfit now for several days because all I remember to pack was my wedding dress and basically nothing else except this Visco Girl t-shirt. So I just have my water and I'm taking a walk right now because I'm gonna start getting ready in probably the next hour. And it's just nice to be like out in nature. This is such a beautiful neighborhood, such a gorgeous place, Paradise Valley. And then I'm gonna go back to the house and start getting ready for my wedding. Let's see the suit. The suit, yeah, let's check it out. Yeah, I went on convench. Oh, that's fire. Sick. That pink. Oh, damn. Combo. 
That is awesome. Yeah, check it out. I went unconventional right <laughs> Dude. Where'd you get it? What's from Rack? Fits you so good. Fits you perfectly. It's a really good company. It ended up being like super discounted randomly. It was on clearance. I didn't even notice. These are sweet. Yeah, right? Oh, those are badass. I love that. I know, the little pattern. Now you guys gotta help me pick out my, if I'm doing a, a uh, pocket square, For and, sure. then, and then bow tie. We gotta figure out who can tie my bow ties. I got you. I, I know the answer to that that question. <laughs> I just go black? I think so, yeah. This one, right? Yeah. Yeah. What about this? Do we do this or no square? You'll probably have to see the outfit. I think so, on. but I think, I think you just go white. We just use the white side of it. Cool. So when did you first meet Joss? First met her through a mutual friend, Jody, who casted Jocelyn on Amazing Race and came back from the show and Jody's like, I have this girl, you gotta meet her. She's amazing and I think you guys would hit it off. So we did. What was your first date? We went on a group hike, which is very like LA-ish <laughs> to have like a group hike meeting friendship thing. And I tried to get some little time in with her. I don't even think she knew which one I was because it was me, Justin, and Hayden. We were all hiking. She didn't really know completely who I was. So I just talked to her a little bit, got her number after that, and then called her the next week, left her voicemail, which she thought was very manly and old school and traditional. And then we went out on a date like a few days later. When did you know Joss was the one? That's a good question. I better be careful how I answer this. <laughs> but I think pretty early on, I don't know, there were just things about her right away that I was super impressed with. And I remember specifically one night, like a few months after dating, we just had this like kind of more serious conversation. And I remember tangibly the next day, I felt oh, yeah. like something switched. Like I just knew, I like fell hard. It was a weird tangible, I think I'm gonna love this girl. I'm like, and then there were a few times after that, before I even told her that I loved her, where I was looking at her in my head, I'm like, this could be the one that I'd get married to. How did you propose, even though you've seen a video? So sunrise hike on uh, Franklin Canyon, surprised her, she had no idea that we were filming. I hired a guy, a drone operator, um, Eshwin and Cameron is his cousin who was flying the drone. Just asked her at like 7.30 a.m. one morning and you can cut to the video to see more. Oh my gosh, look at the new hair I bought. I always say like, it's my own hair because I bought it. Thank you. And anyone who thinks that someone, most, most people don't grow this kind of hair. They don't, I'm sorry. No biotin, no leafy greens, no amount of prayer could give you this hair. That's what I said on Instagram the other day. Also, by the way, Kevin is shooting this video. Kevin, say hello. Oh, there he is. <laughs> Martha Washington. <laughs> it's like so colonial of you. You're about to look like that too. You're so know, American. Right? Watch yourself. How do you feel, Jay? Wow, man. Big bro's getting married. It's insane. When did you first meet Joss? I met Jocelyn on a hike the same day that Chris and Jocelyn met. This, me, this guy, mm -hmm. Jody Wincheski. Jocelyn, we were in Beverly Hills on a hike, and uh, that day when we got home, Chris was like, I'm gonna take Jocelyn out on a date. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> Rest is history, huh? And we all knew right away that they were a good match, without a doubt. Knew instantly. I think we knew before they knew. Oh, for sure. <laughs> I think that's why we love Jocelyn. Love you, Jocelyn. Anything else to add? I know. Can't I know. Celebrate this big I day. Be part of it. I know that. Beautiful. One month after my wedding, which is insane. So, weddings, kids, all at the same time. That's the plan. <laughs> yeah, Hayden. Hayden told too, me, right? No, Hayden told me. Within, like, <laughs> Hayden hey, told me within a few days. I don't need any more days. pressure. I'll tell you that. <laughs> Hayden told me within a few days he thought Jaws was the one. Like yep. within days. 
Seriously, yeah. within days, I knew it. There was something about the way they clicked. I just, I, I knew they have enough in common, and they're both just freaking awesome people. So, yeah, I don't know. Call it, call it intuition. Brian's giving me a foot mask right now. Here it is. Ooh, it's so tingly on my toes. Ooh. Oh my gosh, this feels fantastic. Oh, fun. <laughs> this feels so good. Which is my favorite foot? My left one. Is your left foot your favorite foot? Yeah. Is it because it's just misunderstood? It's just because I feel like it's smaller than the other one. <laughs> my right one is better. Really? Yeah. Mine are both disgusting. Like one of your armpits smells more than the other No, I have no, for sure. one of my armpits sweat so much more. All the feet people are going to love this moment. <laughs> You're welcome. You're welcome. Anything you want to say to them? I love you guys, and I'm excited. One thing, them, you know, I there is zero doubt they are a couple that will last forever. Like it's not even today's day and age. It's like people get divorced. Like it's, you know, everybody, so, yeah. everybody does it. You know, 50% divorce rate. Without a doubt, 100%. This is an everlasting bond, and I I can say that with one million percent confidence, and that's cool. And most people, you can't say that. Well, I'm like I've always just figured Chris is gonna only gonna get married once. You know what I mean? Like, Chris has always struck me as the type of guy, if he hadn't done it by now, like, he's only gonna do it once. And I think Joslyn is absolutely that though. one. It's the big day. It's the big day. Chris and Joss are getting married. This is so amazing. So happy for you guys. Here's to a lifetime of happiness together. <laughs> Make me over! What kind of vibe are we going for today? Dolly Parton. Oh, yeah. oh I love her. How old should I leave these on before my feet fall? So crazy. So, um, I don't know actually. It's, 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 <laughs> it's, you're my first person to do that this one. Year. I wonder what Chris is doing. He's probably yeah. done already. He's, just He's probably drinking right a, right having a cocktail and hanging out, most likely. I hope he is. Let's take some shots. Yeah. Let's take some shots, boys. You know what I was thinking though? It's like, I mean, of course there's like general on the earth is like getting married like oh my gosh it's such a big day it's so exciting everybody's here but I'm like what if you were like this is a mistake I'm like oh my gosh I'm so glad I don't feel like that <laughs> this is probably the smartest decision I've ever made how are you feeling excited man nervous it's craziness huh have you practiced your dancing at all <laughs> kind of today I was like thinking about it a lot practicing a little bit but like every style. You guys are in for a treat. <laughs> every style. Every style. What are my dance moves gonna be like, do you think? Definitely body roll. <laughs> you know Jocelyn. Should you do worm? <laughs> <laughs> worm for sure. Or big <laughs> dance worm. <laughs> Weird, I'm putting on my shoes for my wedding. All right. You have first dance song picked out? Yep. Ready to go? Yep. It was a time in our life we were trying to figure out like next next steps moving forward and there was some uncertainty and basically the song talks about a little bit of uncertainty in the beginning and then the song's called Always and basically the punchline is you and me will be always so that's kind of like it's an Andy Grammer song we saw him in concert so Still. Andy Grammer is a little bit sentimental for us and I'm nervous about the first dance. <laughs> should I prune? Should I bring back a prune? I think so. Prune! <laughs> Mom you prune. Come prune with me. One, two, three. Prune! Did you didn't say anything. <laughs> <laughs> yes, you are, Mom. Okay. One, two, three. Prune! <laughs> that foot mask actually was awesome, Brian. Yeah. 
I was hating on it, but my toes are loving it. It's an avant-garde look to go it's with my couture dress. Work. This is like, Elizabeth, is this a, no, what's it called? Like Louis XIV era. I'm like really? I'm Marie Antoinette, digging oh. in here for like. <laughs> Within a month of each other, man. Oh. She's insane. Might cry a little bit. It's so wild. Did it happen really fast for you guys, like the actual wedding part? Or does it just fly by? Dude, it's fly. It's just, you just black out and then. Yeah, I have a feeling it's gonna be a blur. Crying too. Yeah, but... super emotional. It's just everything hits you at once and then like family's there and it's just like a lot. Yeah. <laughs> yeah? Fire. Looking good? Fire. Sick. Thank you. Love you, baby. Love you. Allie! Oh my gosh, look at that glamazon! on. Get over here, do some posing. Uh, I was doing a little shoulder highlights. I love that swoop, Al. Isn't it great? Yeah. Oh, I do want to mention this. We're not doing a wedding registry. We're doing charity donations. And if anyone watching this video wants to donate, we have two charity links below for people who actually really need things like running water and housing, like That's homeless awesome. teenagers and foster care in That's LA. Awesome. Because we have everything that we need, you know? Uh huh. Ooh, the slow. Oh, no. <laughs> the extra slow. Wow. That's fire. Feeling fresh. Boys. Dude, that's dope. Damn, yeah. Jackie. Oh what? Gosh. <laughs> it, it came. It's here. The hair is here. So do I just like walk very slowly? <laughs> just, just never move or breathe. I'll never we move have or <laughs> We have to walk slow down the aisle. I know. We're never moving or breathing, Mom. Just so you know from now on. Okay. Okay. From here on out. Boys, this is it. It's go time. people. He's picking my nose for me right now. <laughs> this is relatable. Do you want me to pick your nose later? Sure. Okay, cool. Okay. Throw your chin up a little bit, pop your butt. It's a great butt pop. Everything looks better with a little butt pop. Pop, pop, pop. Okay. Did someone help me up? <laughs> Careful. I'm sorry, it's just very tight. Oh, I thought I heard ripping. This oh is God, how sausage is made. No, it, it won't rip. I hope I ate a lot of burritos this week though. <laughs> We're going to get married. How are you feeling? This is wild. We're, we uh, are a few minutes away from the church right now. So, I don't know, I'm kind of speechless. I don't really know what to say. I'm excited, really happy to be hanging with you leading up to this. It's surreal. You know, it's just very surreal. It's like it's hard to even have it register fully and I feel like it's gonna go really fast. Marrying a very beautiful woman, I'm sure. I, I think she is very beautiful, yes. Yep, she is she a very great. marrying a very handsome young man. I appreciate I mean, that. You are styling from head to toe, brother. Really <laughs> Thank you. I'm sure she's gonna be licking her chops when you walk up to <laughs> I like this, this driver, <laughs> like, true. yeah, it's a little advice yes. from the driver, I, I yes. like this. I think I'm the lucky one. Oh, I th you're I, both lucky, I mean, you're both They're both lucky, lucky. yeah. You're blessed, man. You're getting married in the church and your family's there, and Yes. People you love all around you. I mean, that's a wonderful way to start a marriage. Yes, I'm very excited. Once in a lifetime. Mom, do you have any marriage advice for me? No. <laughs> Definitely. No, I'll have to think about okay. it. Okay. <laughs> this dress is actually pretty comfortable. There's no way. 
<laughs> I don't feel anything. It's awesome. Thank you, Netta. Netta Ben Shabu and Ashley from Kinsley James Bridal. Jordan Almonds, Longship Champions. My pleasure. Congratulations. Much. If Thank I never you. see you again, I wish you nothing but love and success and a beautiful marriage. Thank you. All right. You take care. God. Thank okay. you so much. Alrighty. God bless. Bye bye. strength and show me your weakness we're in this together now we're in this together now give me your love and tell me your secrets cause we're in this together now yeah we're in this together now Now, you and me together now. 